<laughs> We're hearing an interesting call by Jamaican sprint great Donald Quarry for local track and field stakeholders to rise up and challenge the current Dr. Warren Blake leadership of the J3S. <laughs> yes, Quarry says the delegates should vote for leadership that would inspire change in the sport and who are more capable and more respected by corporate Jamaica. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. And the Olympic legend doubled down on this call for the new leadership to be highly respected in the corridors of corporate Jamaica. But question, the j 3 has credibility and respectability issues? Many of know that. I thought the J3As was a highly respected, credible, and well-run organization. For sure, it benefited greatly from the massive success of our athletes on the international stage, which enabled it to attract substantial private sponsorship as well as support from the sport's international governing body. That was my impression of the J3As. I don't know where Don Quarry gets all of this from. <laughs> no, sir. Me feel Don Quarry and mix up the J3As with the JFF. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. All this thing about respect of corporate Jamaica. Me feel Don Quarry is confusing Dr. Warren Black with Dr. Mike Ricketts. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. But we all make mistakes. We <laughs> <laughs> make a mistake. <laughs> Sorry about that, sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs>